what is actually happening right now? What is going on with Democrat and liberal news sources that are finally admitting that Biden has a mental decline issue? Is it because they don't think he has the capability of beating Donald Trump in the upcoming election? I would say yes, because these people are so sick that they don't care. They'll double down on anything. He could be the worst person on, on earth and they would make him out to be God's angel. They don't care. And so when you look at these news stories, keep that in freaking mind that these people will lie to your face about anything. And so when they are starting to acknowledge something, there is a different motive. It's not that they're trying to actually give you the news. They're, and they're, not, they're not trying to actually be uh, honest with what's going on with Biden because we heard over and over again during his campaign, the last campaign, that he had a speech impediment and it was actually rude for you to say anything otherwise and then as he would walk upstairs and fall you would they would push back and say wow that's so rude of you my old grandpa falls during stairs too he's totally fine he's his mental decline is not there now that the mental decline is there now they're like wait a second maybe gavin newsom or, or michelle obama can run we need to get him out and so i think that's what they're doing i think this this story is very interesting to me because this is something you should already know biden uses note cards everywhere he goes literally everywhere i feel like you could take him on any kind of podcast and he's gonna have like cheat sheets in front of him he's gonna be reading from the sheets he's like the type of person that if you were to ask him any question about even his uh what do you what does your morning routine look like in the morning uh joe biden uh would love to know if you're drinking coffee in the morning or what what are you what are you, what are you doing you reading a little devotion in the morning what are you doing down there boy he would probably be like uh uh, I wake up in the morning uh, before everyone else, <laughs> um, read all the news, uh, write some myself, do all my tweets for the day, and uh, tell Cream Dream Ab Abdul Jabbar what to say on the podium today. I think this is the funniest thing. So they talk about why it matters, but apparently that even the smaller events, he's still using note cards, and that's what the big thing is. Yeah, duh. Because he doesn't know what's going on. But you're not going to take this from me, Democrats or liberal news outlets. You're not going to take this from me. You're going to run him. And he is going to be the presidential nominee. I don't care. I'm pushing for him. He doesn't have a mental decline. He's totally fine. He's doing a great job. Keep saying that same thing over and over again. It's not working. But I want you to keep saying it over and over again. Because you're not replacing him with a better candidate in time for the election. You're not gonna do that to us. You're not gonna pull Bernie Sanders and just, even though Bernie won that one time, just switch it at the end. You're not gonna do that to us. I know that's what you're trying to do. You're trying to make the case that he just bows out. This is Joe Biden. And Joe Biden once said, nobody works with the Bidens. <laughs> at a, a site where I think there was like a hurricane and <laughs> some guy came up to him and said that to him and he they both laughed about it. Nobody mess with them, okay? These cheat sheets are not real. You're, it's a figment of your imagination. He's doing great. He's totally fine. He, I will change my rhetoric when it comes November. But in the meantime, I want you conservative, conservatives, people on the right, libertarians, whatever, who don't like Joe Biden, I want you to keep saying to your Democrat friends, he's just fine. He's just fine. His age is just a number. His mental decline is a right-wing talking point. Just keep saying that. And to the point where they start to be like, wait a minute, I thought you were against him. And you're like, what are you talking about? <laughs> start to play, you know, re do the reverse card on some of your friends because they need to start f feeling like you feel daily. <laughs> where you read the news and you're like, that is not what actually happened. That, lie, that headline is a lie. Um, you need to do the reverse card on them. Start start giving them their own treatment they try to give to you daily. Have a wonderful day. Remember, we have a president that requires note cards for simple questions because he is the smartest, hard, most hardworking. He runs circles around KJP, like she said, over and over again in press conferences. He is doing just fine. Have a great day. Remember, Joe Biden could... Get us into World War III before this is all over, and then we're freaking...